for this system we're going to be using four gigs of Kingston DDR 800 RAM as you notice these sticks are a little bit shorter on the height um, that's the marvels of newer technology and as far as putting these in you have four memory slots in this motherboard um, go through and install the memory you want to first slide the uh, connectors out of the way the little clasps and as you can tell you have uh, yellow slots and black slots the colors match up with each channel so you have channel one channel one both of which being yellow channel two being black and channel two being uh, channel two is black I was about to say <laughs> the reverse of what I want to do yellow is channel one black is channel two so you want to put memory stick in both yellow ones before you start putting them into the black ones to get dual memory speed uh, you want to have matching memory sticks so in this case we have a memory kit of two sticks that guarantees that both will be exactly the same I have seen uh, memory of the same part number uh, where you buy two of them like let's say you buy two one gig sticks and for the purpose of making a dual uh, configuration dual channel configuration but there's either just a slight difference in the part number and the system will see it as two different types of memory and it will not go into dual channel mode so if possible buy a dual uh, stick set or a kit uh, so to say as far as removing the memory sticks out of here is pretty simple um, usually you can just do a little bit of a wiggle uh, on one side it comes up pretty easy pick one side up the other side conveniently came out for me and there is a notch here in the middle of the memory stick and I of course am conveniently grounded and you'll see that this notch is going to match up with that notch there on the board yeah I got the good angle on this so you can see how exactly it is going to line up in there it's just a matter of putting the memory stick in I'm trying to get you a good angle on it hope that turns out good because I had to turn my head and basically just go through and click it now if you have just like I did thought you had a good angle where it was lined up and it's not you're going to get this rocking action I should have not put that power supply in yet but you'll get the rocking action where you go and push one side in and the other side kind of feels like it comes up that's because you kind of see it there I hope uh, you're not going to be able to but the notch is further down than I want it to be so I have to actually turn the memory stick around and put it in and yes I did do that on purpose so I will show you what happens if you put the memory stick in wrong <laughs> I made you think I was doing it so correctly and normally you want to try and put even pressure on both sides but I'm doing this with one hand and the memory should just snap right on in or click in I should say uh, you shouldn't have to put in here a huge amount of force if you're pushing on it and doesn't want to go in you are using too much force and you could break your board or the memory stick or both and it will not be covered under warranty any shape way or form so do take your time I want to go ahead and put in the other memory stick the exact same way uh, taking note and it works exactly the same way and that's it now we have our memory installed take a good look at your connectors my heads in the way take a good look at your connectors here make sure that they are all even if any of these guys are sticking out a little bit uh, maybe that it's not correctly seated and just kind of give them a little push make sure they are in that's it that's as easy as it is to install in memory 
And great thing about Kingston Memory, just a note, lifetime warranty. Ever goes bad, you pretty much uh, email them, and they will send you new memory uh, to replace it. Um, the only exception to that is if they no longer even produce the memory, well, you're kind of out of luck. So don't try cashing in on something that's, you know, 20 years old. But that's it for memory. Next thing I'm going to do is CD drive.